Hello, this is Brioc and I Die to Games. Uh, today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to um, change the resolution on your private server Nosomi Final Fantasy XI configuration. So once you've downloaded Nosomi, it comes up with two icons. They look like this. One looks like the traditional Final Fantasy XI configuration icon. The other is a little Moogle with a night hat. Uh, you aren't going to do anything with the Final Fantasy XI configuration button. If you were to open it up, it looks like the traditional configuration. You're not going to touch it. If you touch it, it doesn't do anything. So you can see right now that I've got a couple of graphics resolutions and menu resolutions that are set up. Those are actually set up through the Ashida Nosomi launcher, which is what we're going to do everything in. So you can close that out. If anything uh, on the FFXI config, you would just keep it at a uh, default. So you can hit default there. So from here, you've got a few options on the Ashita site, and these are the main configurations where you can launch the, the game. Uh, you can hit launch game at any point. If you have the 4K resolution set up where it's coming up big on like one or two monitors and it's just way oversized, what you're gonna do is right click on the monitor size that you want. In this case, I think for most people, it's going to be 4K. You're going to hit Edit Configuration. And it comes up with this, which is the boot configuration information. You don't need to do anything with that. What you need to do is go into the window settings. And for a 4K monitor, uh, you're looking at a window size of 3840 by 2160. Uh, I play in windowed mode personally, so it does not show the border. There's no menu at the top, but it does take up the whole screen, and then you can exit the screen to type in Twitch or something like that. The startup position is always negative one. That's how it starts. Your background size is up to you. Some people play at 3840 by 2160. Some pay, play at double that, and double that is pretty normal if you have a decent graphics card. The menu size, though, is the UI, and that's what's really small. So even if you get the, the size of the window to fit your monitor, your menu and your health and all of that might be super small. You want the menu size to be half of your window size. So in this case, for me, it's 9, 1920 by 1080, which is half of the 3840 by 2160. So that's how you set the resolutions. Now, we're not done just yet. Before you boot up the game, you're going to save at the bottom. There's a little save configuration. And that would bring us back to the normal menu. Let's X out of this. From there, you're going to go and right-click on Nisomi XI, the launcher. You're going to go to Properties. And when you go into Properties, there's something called Compatibility. And the Compatibility has Change High DPI Settings, which is one of the options here. You'll click on that. And there is a button that you can check called Override High DPI Scaling Behavior. And you're going to scale by the application. So check that box, hit OK. And if you've done everything correctly here, setting the right uh, resolution, changing the DPI, you should be able to play the game uh, perfectly fine at a 4K resolution. So that's it. I'm going to be streaming tonight. If you like this, it was helpful, hit the follow button. I don't think I have any YouTube followers, so it'd be really cool to have one. Uh, but more than that, check me out on Twitch. It is Brioc Dies the Games. Thank you very much.